Hello everyone. Welcome to Russell's Classroom. Today we will solve a nice math problem. This question is y to the power x minus x is equal to 77. x y is equal to what? How to solve this interesting math problem? So solution. Our question, it will be y to the power x minus x is equal to 77 it take our question now at this moment i can see this expression it will be y to the power x and bracket and here is exponent is one minus this x and exponent is also one here is equal to 77 now at this moment i can see here y to the power x bracket and power is one so this one it will be two divide 2, 2 divide 2 it will be 1, then here x to the power 2 divide 2 is equal to 77, we know that 2 divide 2 is also 1. Now here, I can see it will be y to the power x in bracket power is 1 over 2 times 2, this half times 2 it will be 2 over 2, minus and here x to the power here is 1 over 2 times this 2 is equal to 77. You can see this time this, it will be this. Now here, at this moment, I can see here, y to the power this x times this half, it will be x over 2 bracket power is this 2. According to the exponential, y to the power n and whole to the power m, this time this, it will be this, minus here, x to the power the i take this half here and i take this two inside the bracket here is equal to 77 then at this moment i can easily here y to the power x over two bracket power is two and this x to the power one over two till the square root x and bracket power is two is equal to 77. now we'll find out here if you think this is a this is b so you know that s square minus v square it will be a plus b times a minus b according to this property so i can see easily according to this identity it will be y to the power x over 2 plus square root x times y to the power x over 2 minus square root x is equal to 77 so at this moment we'll find out here is this factor 77 so first of all i can see easily here a plus b always greater than a minus b now this 77 i can see it will be 77 times 1 or 11 times 7. it is also 7 times 11 but it is not possible it is possible because of that a plus b always greater than a minus b so this is possible this is possible now easily our first case our first case here y to the power x over 2 plus square root x is equal to 77 and we'll find out here other case it will be this is equal to 1 so it will be y to the power x over 2 minus negative square root x it will be 1 this is our first case so and our other case here it's okay i solve this case later so here if i subtract both equation so this sign is changed this sign is changed so it will be this this cancel out because of that this this same but this square root x plus this square root x it will be 2 square root x is equal to this minus this it will be 76. now at this point if i divide both side by 2 we'll find out a square root x is equal to 38 here is x and y is in a channel number then if i use both side square root we are find out here is x it will be one four 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 i mean 38 whole square i use both side whole squares okay square root is cancel x is equal to this so we'll find out our final solution here x is equal to one four 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 but y is equal to what so you can see here here y to the power 
x over 2x it will be 1 4 4 4 over 2 plus square root 1 4 4 4 because of that x is equal to this is equal to 77 now you can see easily here y to the power 1 4 4 4 divide 2 it will be 7 to 2 is equal to 77 minus 38 square root 1 4 4 4 it will be 38 and if i move on this value in this side it will be negative 38 now at this moment you can see here y to the power 7 to 2 it will be 39 then here y is equal to 7 to 2 and here is square root 39 this is the value of y but recall remember that x and y is natural number so we find out here is x is equal to 1444 and y is equal to 722 root 39 but case 2 here i can see easily according to case 2 it will be y to the power x over 2 plus square root x times and here y to the power x over 2 minus square root x it will be 11 times 7 now this is equal to 11 this is equal to 7 so okay now at this moment i can see here y to the power x over 2 plus square root x it will be 11 then here y to the power x over 2 minus square root x it will be 7 now if i subtract both equation i mean here is minus this is plus this is minus so you can see it will be this this cancel out it will be 2 square root x and 11 minus 7 it will be 4 then if i divide both side by 2 we'll find out here is square root x is equal to 2 i divide this 4 by this 2 it will be 2 then here if i use both side whole square then it will be x and here is 4 so we are find out here is x is equal to 4 but y is equal to 4 so you can see here y to the power y to the power x over 2 x it will be 4 over 2 minus square root 4 is equal to 7 now here y to the power 2 then it will be negative 2 square root 4 it will be 2 then here is 7 then you can see here y square is equal to 9 then here y is equal to 3 this is our final answer so you can see here x comma y it will be 4 comma 3 this is the value of x y in this maths problem in this maths olympiad question thank you all if you enjoyed this video please subscribe my channel for other interesting video goodbye take care